We discuss how to format grid lines differently using error bars of scatter line chart. Firstly, we are discussing how to create a Como chart without plotting blank cells. Secondly, chart data table are made clean. Lastly, grid lines are formatted differently using vertical error bars of scatter line chart. We start from the data table, which may not be fully compatible WTH Excel chart. Cell of zero value is left blank using in formula for clean looking data table. This is formulated using Excel function if. If cell value is computed as zero, then the cell is left as blank using. 1. Create a combination chart as the first trial. Take the steps. Select chart data range. Choose insert tab on the ribbon. Press an icon for combination chart. An error message is prompted. It is not possible to create a chart due to cells left blank. 2. Create chart from more or less scratch by using a recommended chart function. Select chart data range. Choose insert and press recommended chart. Select best fit chart. Move the chart to your position. Resize by pulling the chart area. 3. Specify the chart type and axis of each series. Follow the procedures. Right click the chart. Select change chart type on the shortcut menu. On the dialog of change chart type. Confirm chart type and axis of each series. 4. Finish chart elements of the chart. Align plot area with chart data range. Add grid lines. Position legend, probably moving to top. Format Y axis. You can take note that blank cells are plotted as part of chart in conjugation. It would be better not to show the blank cells. 5. Blank cells filled with hash n forward slash error mark. Not to plot the blank cells on the chart, we need to replace the blank cells with n forward slash error. All the double quote in the formulas are repulsed with Excel NAR function. Hash n forward slash are filled in the cells which were blank. Now initially blank cells are not plotted in the chart due to the Excel NAR function. 6. Hash n forward slash in the cells are made invisible by changing to white. This is done using conditional formatting function. Follow the steps below. Choose conditional formatting in styles group. Select new rule in the shortcut menu. In the window select a rule type on the new formatting rule dialog. Select format only cells then contain. Select errors for cell value. Press Format button to activate Format Cell dialog. Chang font color to white. 7. Format grid line for year change. Step 1. Make a additional chart data appending to original chart data table. First row starts from 0.5 and increase by 1, which is for category axis. Along the next row, enter the value of maximum y-axis for the month of January, and enter 0 for the other months. Step 2. Add scatter line series chart. Right-click the chart and choose select data. Press add and define the series name and data range. Edit the horizontal, category, axis labels. Change the chart type of the new added series to stair line. Step 3. Add error bars and format the scatter line chart. Take the following steps. 1. Add error bars. 2. For the vertical error bar, choose minus direction. With no cap. 3. Enter the fixed value same as maximum value of the scatter chart. 
4 chart wire axis minimum set to 0. 5 for the horizontal error bar, set the fixed value to 0. 6 format the scatter lying chart, lying not visible. This will make the year guide lines formatted differently from other guide lines. Year guide lines are formatted differently this way.